I'm in the north woods of Wisconsin, in the town of Merrill, at the T.B. Scott Mansion. For over 100 years, people have talked about this mansion being haunted. People seeing apparitions, disembodied balls of light, phantom footsteps moving through the building, mysterious rapping and knocking, mysterious lights, all kinds of odd activity are said to take place in this building. But I'm not here just because it has a haunted reputation. I'm here, of course, for the dare, or more accurately, the curse. Long before the mansion was here, this was Native American land. And it was said that a chief cursed this land due to the death of his daughter. There are several variations as to why he cursed the land. Some say that his daughter was impregnated by a white man and she committed suicide. Others say that when the white people came here, they brought disease and she caught this disease and passed on. And the chief buried his daughter and cursed the land that any white person that would dare visit the grave would be cursed for all eternity. So you might be wondering what this has to do with the T.B. Scott Mansion. Well, you probably guessed that according to legend, the mansion is built right over the grave of that young Native American woman. And maybe the curse is real. Many people have had bad things happen, whether living or working here. T.B. Scott himself, the one who wanted the building constructed, died before even setting foot in the building. His wife suffered the same fate, their child died, and numerous other people that lived and worked here suffered the same fate as T.B. Scott. So I'm going to take this dare and visit the cursed area. Obviously, there's no marker for the alleged grave that the mansion sits on top of. But if you're going to take this dare, I recommend you do it as quick as you can. As you can see, the place has been abandoned for several years and is in bad shape. There's a lot of argument over whether they're going to try to restore it or just simply tear it down. And due to the bad condition it's in, most likely it will get torn down. So visit while you still can. As for me, another dare completed and keep an eye out.